Hello everyone, in this video we are going to build a small application Node.js application where we will fetch the uh, Shopify products by using their Node modules So I have uh, created a folder Shopify admin API Now press Ctrl Shift C from Windows and it will open a command prompt Let me just uh, bigger the font size and here you will type npm in it and that will create a uh, press enter 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 and enter and that will create a package.json file in your folder now go back again and install express so npm install express we are going to use Express for this project. So now go back here and create a new file app.js and type const express equal to require express and then const app is equal to express function and we need a port const port is equal to 5000 and app dot listen and we're going to pass port and then callback function where we will console log server is running at port Not that. So, power should be capital. Okay, now we need to define a route app dot get and at homepage route we are going to pass a callback function and in callback function we are going to give two arguments uh, request and res and Res dot send h1 yeah. our app is running now go back to the command prompt and type node mon app dot js and server is running now open that application in the browser type localhost 5000 and now you can see our app is running now we need to add the shopify module so search shopify nord api and it will take you to the shopify nord api module and copy this and go back to the application and press control shift c and paste that here now it is installing the new package for shopify node api so now go back here again and copy this 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 thing copy that and paste that over here so we we call this uh, we put that in the const variable shopify and we create a new instance of shopify and here we need to pass your shop name api key and password so let's uh, grab that from the admin go to the settings and click on apps and sales channel then click on develop apps and create a new app you need to create a new app like uh, Nord so you can name it anything create that and then we need to configure the ad admin scope let's say read products and you can 
you can uh, read and write products save that and from here AP credentials you need to install the app install that and from here you can get app the product API key and API password reveal that one time you will see then copy that so And now you can see I have added this package required.env where I have uh, put all the credentials of Shopify and then I call them by using process.env.shopname. These are the variable names and you can always put them in .env file so no one can see your credentials. Now let's uh, go back to the uh, Shopify node module and uh, we need to copy this uh, shop order we are going to grab the products so let's copy that and then I will add app dot get and slash products and here I am going to pass a sync function request and response and then um, I will paste this and we are going to grab the Shopify products not orders so clear changes with the product and limit would be 5 and here products and products we are not going to console log them we are going to uh, send them response in the browser so our response dot send we're going to ask products <coughs> products and let's add a weight in front of that so if I click on the products and now you can see we have a five products list game over first five products as you can see and we can change the limit from here let's say only one product and reload the page again and now we have only one product and this is how you can grab the products from Shopify admin using Node.js